Hi friends, Tracy here from All Things Real Estate. And on today's video, I usually I go through and do a page with you. And we've been doing it a few different ways. But today I wanna just show you a few of the pages that are in here, cause I know that people are curious about that. So the 368 Real Estate Marketing Ideas, Business Tips and Manifesting Journal was created by me to help you all with your marketing and to stay fresh and relevant and to bring up things that you maybe haven't thought of because you guys are so busy realtoring that working on your business sometimes is sent to the wayside. So hopefully this book will help you at least get you inspired and encouraged and try something new every once in a while or work on something that's working and just show you the, or get you to think about some of the things that, you know, are working and not working in your business. So let's just open up a couple of pages. I filled out some of them, so I don't know if we're going to come across any of those or not, but let's see number 44, auditing your marketing plan. It's always a good idea to go and look and check everything, see what it's What's working, what's not? What will you manifest today? Let's see. Go through your social profiles. What message or vibe are you giving your audience? Read it when you go to your social media, read your bio and things and read it from the perspective of somebody that has never met you and maybe found, saw your sign, stalked you on social media. What's their perception of you? 85, what does your conversion ladder look like? Look up conversion ladder if you don't know what that is because I don't have a ton of time on this video, but you should definitely have some sort of organization, like an organizational chart on how you're converting your leads and gaining them. 112, where are you not trusting yourself? That's a pondering question. 111, what is your legacy? Does your journal, your journey align with your legacy? And we'll just do a couple more here. 177, do you have a pre-inspection checklist for your sellers? Add something new to your business today. And let me see, I wanna show you a special, some of the special pages that are in here. I will make this much money this month. Now, this might be something that you wanna dog ear or put this in your calendar to, at the end of the month, maybe set your goal for the month. And then at the end of the month, check and see if you've, have you reached that goal, exceeded it? Where are you at with that? There's another one in here about for the year and we'll do just a few more. Number 189, when was the last time you took a break? I started to fill this out and I wrote down some of the obstacles that I was having about taking a break. So saving a certain amount of money, getting my passport because it expired, where to go and maybe how to track ideas. I'm taking my kids on a holiday this time for the first time ever and a single mom couldn't really afford that kind of stuff but we're going to make it happen and save up and i'll get involved and take a family trip and let's do 188 do a little something extra to thank the co-agent on your next deal and then let's just do one more let's see don't wait until it's too late we'll end on 264 that's a good one thank you everyone in the back let's see Get this closed, be intentional.